I wasn't planning to start my video yet but this thing happened so let's roll it we're gonna be following this beautiful creek up the mountain for rainforest doing maybe 12 kilometer loop coming back this way as well and along the way trying to spot different species of snakes that live in this area I'm hoping to find red belly black snake which is my favorite maybe common coastal python cubac snake but also I've heard uh, taipans and eastern browns living here so if we get lucky I'll show the snakes to you guys just shows you bloody hell I need to watch out new water on those wet stones because they basically they are wet 24 7 for weeks possibly so covered in in slime and moss I just wanted to show you the waterfall so let's do it again this time more carefully what I slipped on was just this it's like glass, like ice and because it's at the angle it was just drop here luckily not even a scratch because it's like sliding on ice look at all those stuff falls unfortunately it looks like could be tank toads which is sad but that's the reality of Queensland this place is absolutely infested with cane toads and there's nothing we can do about it absolutely nothing I haven't failed my mission can you spot it? can you see it? Ah, it looks like Kyobak. Look, it swims beautifully in this water. But yes, that's what I wanted to show you. It just... It sits here in those little ponds and hunts for frogs. Look, it actually dives deep into the leaves. Wants to hide. Yeah, it's, it's a Kyobak. And it's disappeared underwater. Just amazing. This fig tree drops all the leaves, just looks unreal, beautiful. But that's a serious obstacle. Not going through that bloody bush. So we need to go this way. Oh. Something just bit me. Feels like a big nasty ant. Who knows? Maybe a spider or just a this thorny bush. Ah, this is nasty. What is that? That's razor sharp. Look at this. Just, just ah. Look at those spikes. It's everywhere here. So I guess that's the plan to avoid and I'm in the middle of it. Up, up, far out. Even offshoots like this, they just rip through my fingers. You just touch it and stings like hell. But yeah, and it's everywhere here. What now? <laughs> uh. 
and that's where we can find more snakes as well just need to be careful if, if I get bitten here I'm fucked I'm fucked look at that that's what I went through just now far out okay that's a clearing you just need to persist with the plan sometimes like what's the alternative it's not much really look at the size of this snake just want to show you how long this thing is and how mellow he doesn't want to strike me I can basically come within striking distance now just put my hand here underneath him as he's just gonna go on his way still need to watch out not to flip they're just absolutely harmless they just get rats and small dogs alright snake you survived my encounter just enjoy the bush okay and you've made me the happiest person on the planet right now and my mission I have to say my mission has been accomplished I got a kill back and over two meter python Woo! I must be close to some houses or oh, possibly that's a bag of someone's property there's a demolished shed over there oh, lovely perfect habitat for snakes guys top of the ridge should be road I'll go and get my lunch I'm on the top of the mountain and this is proper rainforest just amazing and water is nice and cold oh, it's a blessing for my feet Looks like I found the track. Yeah. Morning. Morning. Is it far to the road? Yeah, like uh, 200 meters maybe. Okay. Too... So it just goes that way? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Excellent. I came from Cedar Creek. Yeah. Oh, wow. Three hours. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Anyway, see ya. Got some hitchhikers. Ah, those. Those leeches. Wow, this leech is full of blood now. Let me take it out. It's so slippery, I can't even. Yeah, it attached itself. It attached itself again. You little sucker. Stop it. Just stop it. Look at my hand. Just one big scratch. Same my legs. Oh, there's another, another one. Might, might. Luckily, you can't even feel them because they, they have some kind of anticoagulant, but as they bite through, some kind of anesthetic as well. Uh, blood keeps flowing. You don't feel it. Everyone's happy. <laughs> Little suckers. By this truck and then down following the creek. Should be fun. Can't resist myself. Need to get on that tree. Slippery as hell as well, but we're at the top of Green Falls. 
So that's being Cedar Creek. That's the end of the track. Just beautiful spot near Brisbane. And going down is always harder. Much easier to sleep. That's a serious waterfall. Wouldn't like to fall here. So super in here. Made it! Just as I sleep, I looked up and there's another snake. It's just chilling here on a ledge. It's got this little got these little yellow marks on the side of his mouth. So that is not a brown snake. We're gonna identify it later, but look. look. Just tiny little snake and just gonna go away to safety. Gorgeous. Just chilling. Just chilling, I'm too tired. Last 300 meters were shocking. And guys, if you plan to do this on your own, take a safety beacon. If something happens, no one's gonna know. And it's too hard to get down. This is, oh my goodness. Whew. All right, we're here. I did the look. That's the creek we followed. Going up. And that's the Cedar Creek. We came down now. This is our look of happy man, eh? I'm tired as hell. Scratch to bits. But honestly, that was one of the most enjoyable hike I've ever done in my life. And probably liked it that much because I've done it solo and there was no rushing. Could do it at my pace. And just this adrenaline rush when you have to decide where to go, whether to continue, whether to turn back, where it's too risky. What and this little anxiety at the back of your head what if something bad happens and you're stuck here with no reception all those things just make it special and then the fact that I can actually video this and put it out there for people to watch oh, I just love that stuff We're here, the place where I sleep. Look how deep it is there. Can't see the bottom. Oh, just unbelievable. Oh. I just really hope you enjoyed the, this video. You enjoyed the walk, the scenery. You know, if you're not from Australia or not from Queensland, that's what you can do here. 30 minutes drive from the capital city enjoy rock climbing enjoy creeks enjoy the nature and if you dare to do it you can catch some snakes hey just such beautiful creatures so this is it for today stay safe everyone and until the next time See ya.